It's game day here at the University of Phoenix Stadium where about an hour and a half Mexico will be playing Guatemala. I'm standing next to Mr. Tom Marshall for the Mexican Soccer Show. Tom, how do you see the atmosphere? What are you seeing out here? I'm, I'm feeling heat. Yeah. It's <laughs> heat. But yeah, no, great atmosphere. Always is with these Mexico games in the United States. Like, you know, you can't see it, but groups of people jumping around, dancing. There's always music pumping. Uh, yeah, everyone's uh, into have a, a good, good Sunday out. The first game is already underway. Uh, not that many Trinidad and Tobago, not that many Cuban fans. No, I, th I think there's more Mexico fans. I mean, I think it's going to be very close to being sold out. Yeah. Or, 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 or in fact, I think it's sold out now, isn't it? Hey, we're looking to see if it, if it is actually sold out. Um, about the game itself, any anything recent, anything that you're seeing already uh, that hasn't come out yet that you're starting to see for the two hours before the game? I think the the only thing we've got to look out for is Gallito Vasquez, if he's in or not, because the rest of the team is going to be exactly the same as against uh, Honduras in the, in the, not Honduras, who was it? It was Cuba. <laughs> Cuba. In the first game, so um, yeah, I think, I think Herrera's got his team fixed and... Um, you know, he, he needs a good performance from today because he wants to set his team in stone before the before the bigger and more difficult tests uh, come later down and later on in the tournament. Uh, yesterday we were at the press conference. Uh, how did you see Piojo calm? Uh, he didn't have a player. He apologized for not having one of the players. And then there was a secret kind of uh, a practice outside of Phoenix. Uh, what was that all about? What do you think that was a, a strategy? Honestly, it's difficult for the Mexican team because wherever they practice, fans find out somehow, even if they don't let anybody know. And and the, you know, the, the trying out tactics, trying out formations, and they don't want people there. So it is. It has been difficult, but it's not the same for like with with full respect, Cuba or Trinidad, because they can practice where they want, and there's very few people there. So I think he wants to be behind closed doors so that people don't see what you know set pieces, str uh, strategies, and stuff like that. So. Uh, well, we're going to be here uh, making videos and making sure that you're getting all the news from the Mexico versus Guatemala. I'm Wiso with Mr. Tom Marshall for the Mexican Soccer Show.